I've got the Excel file that you sent me Wolfgang if I open that up in Excel it looks like this um, you can see that these are the cells you're obviously having problems with probably soft returns line feeds I can't actually see the character codes in there so what I do is if I just open it in studio I'll just use the translate single document there's the Excel file and if I just um, I'll disable that TM I'll leave the TM open for a second this is a, a default TM there's no um, there's no segmentation rules other than default in there at the moment this is probably what you're getting and we can see it opens up and all of those lines are in the same cell if I click on the show white space characters you can see when I do that this is definitely a line feed that's what they are so all I need to do is to add a rule to my segmentation rules to break these on a line feed so what I do is I go over to my translation memories there's my TM if you haven't got it in your list you just you can see easy enough I'll just show you how to do that I can just remove it from from the list that doesn't delete it if I open the T up again TM up again there it is it puts it back in the list again so all I'm going to do is right click settings go to my language resources and then my segmentation rules and then I click on edit and in here I'm just going to add a new rule and I'll add a rule for a line break if I can spill it so I'll say before break anything after break anything my break characters I actually want to use a regular expression in here but I need to use it to do that in the advanced view so if I just put something like that in there just so I can identify where I need to put the regular expression when I get to the advanced so you'll see what I mean in a second I click on there you can see the XXX's I don't want these square brackets around it that's just what the regex has done so I'll change that to a backslash n which is what I need to pick up a line feed this is just a regular expression I click on OK, OK, and OK. And now if I come back and I translate the single document, take my Excel file, there's my line break, same file, I click on OK. And this time they're all on separate lines, which I guess is what you want. It may well segment like this in other tools by default. That's fair enough. The reason it doesn't do that for Studio is because we have a far bigger user base, and over the years, the vast majority of users do not want. Um, soft returns to break in this way. So the default through Trados and Studio over the years has been to do it like this. But if you want to break it, you can see it's really easy. You just add a rule to the segmentation rule on the TM. I hope that was easy anyway. You can see it takes no more than a couple of seconds. Um, half a minute, a minute at most. Thank you.